Hi, friends. All for art and art for all. Yay. Let's do a... Let's do a square. Start our doodles with a square. Let's use a blotter if we are drawing somewhere where the ink might go through. So I'm going to make a big square to start my doodle. Doesn't have to be perfect. Just square like is good. So there's my square that I'm going to start in. And I'm going to make two lines up and fairly evenly. So that's why I'm kind of looking at where is that going to go. So two lines that will give me three even columns. The up and downs are columns. And then we're going to make three rows by just drawing two lines. So fairly evenly. And here's a trick if you want to make a straight line. I am going to do two. So I kind of draw an airline where I'm going. This is where I'm going to start and this is roughly where I'm going to finish. And I, I sometimes look at that, make myself kind of a start and a finish to help myself make a straight line. Now I'm going to make a square in the upper corner, the upper left corner in this case, in each of my squares. So you don't have to make it thicker the way I am. I'm just putting a square in the upper right corner of all my squares. And I want them lined up kind of, right? So that lines up pretty good. So this one, I'm going to line that up. It's going to go over and be lined up pretty well with this guy. So sometimes that's what I do is I draw through. I go in the air and then oh, that's where I'm going to start. And then this is where I want it lined up. I'm going to draw it in the air. Oh, that's where I'm going to start. So you should have these squares in the upper right corner. The upper right corner. Go ahead and go back and straighten them out, square them out if you want. I made mine a little thicker. I made my lines a little thicker for those squares. It'll look pretty cool if you do that. Right there. Don't do it so thick that you can't tell there's any white space around it. Now I'm going to draw a diagonal from the bottom of my little square to the bottom of the square it's in. So from there to there, bottom of my little square to the corner of the square it's in. Bottom of my little square to the square it's in. Bottom of my little square to the square it's in. Bottom of my little square to the square it's in. And so on down all nine squares. Okay. And then I'm just going to, you can see where this is starting to look cool. I'm going to just do two lines inside that are parallel to the square, the little square. So up and up, over and up, up and up, rather over and up. So over and up and over and up, over and up and over and up. And I'm going to try and make it so that I can get two lines around each of my squares. Oops, that was really close. It's okay. 
even when things don't come out exactly how I was hoping, I find that if I keep going, it all comes out when you look at it all together. Okay, friends. So if you wanted to, you could come in here and fill this in, this little square that's left. Make it look pretty cool. I'm uh, filling mine in. You could also be doing some of your lines thicker. So filling in this last, filling in my squares. Give the eye some place to kind of be attracted to. It's gonna kind of grab my attention, putting in that dark and then maybe make this line a little thicker, make this line a little thicker, this line a little thicker, this line a little thicker, a little thicker, a little thicker, a little thicker. That's probably bothering some people. Yay! There we go. I thought about doing something different in there just to be silly, but I didn't. All right, friends. And that is our daily doodle today.